Keeping cool can burn a hole in your wallet. We've all felt it, but it doesn't have to. Melissa Fenske reports on how you can keep cool without going broke. As the temperatures outside are going up, it may be tempting to lower the temperature on your AC, but if you want to save, leave it alone. When temperatures spike up into the 90s, some air conditioners have trouble keeping up, you know, if you set it too low. A programmable thermostat will save you the most in the long run, keeping the AC at a higher temperature when you're out of the house. But if you don't have one, having your equipment checked and cleaned once a year will ensure it's working as efficiently as possible. But we can check the refrigerant level. That's the next big thing. One of the most common problems that people have with their air conditioner not working is that they have a dirty filter like this one. Look, there's just dust everywhere. And when there's dust there, the air is not going to get through. A lot of uh, cottonwood that we're seeing on, on the outdoor units that we need to just get out there and with a garden hose and get those washed off so we can keep the unit running at peak efficiency. An air conditioner will usually last 12 to 20 years. A new one can cost anywhere from 2500 up. Most technicians suggest keeping the temperature at around 74 degrees for optimum cooling and savings. In Lansing, Alyssa Fenske, Fox 47 News. Now, if you have an extra bedroom or other rooms that you're you're not using in your house, be sure to close the vents and keep those doors shut. That will help push the cold air into the other rooms that you are using.